Hi everyone, it's me, Freddie T. Power, with a second video on another laptop fan. Now, the last video I made was for this one here. This one was called, uh, if I'm pronouncing it correctly, the Lano version 10 gaming laptop cooler. Now, we all know how that one went. And this one was, let's see, to say to go to 3,500 RPMs. And, well, I found another one. And as you can see, I purchased it. This one here is 5,000 RPMs. So, we're hoping it's what? More powerful, right? Well, we're about to see in a second. And also, as you can see, same thing here. For rapid cooling gaming laptop. There you go. Now, let's see what they have here advertising. Now, the other one, the first one that I tested, as you can see, this one had vents on the top and bottom left and right this one here the new one it's one fan in the middle just like the other one and air comes out from everywhere once again it's supposed to go inside the bottom of the intake of the laptop and cool your laptop well let's see if that's true and as you can see industrial turbofan 5000 rpms and what else do they show advertise here as you can see that's how you lay down the laptop it's very simple nothing difficult to do and then they have the the higher you lift it up then you may want to use these pegs here to prevent it from sliding down but the foams are so good that, I mean, I use it, but it doesn't slide down. And there you go. It's tilted all the way up. And let's see what the video shows. Okay, uh, we don't need to see that video. I'm doing my own review, don't need to record the video review. And let's see what else they got here. So the video already shows, here's breaking it down. And again, 5,000 RPM. And they have different foams for different sizes of your laptop and as you can see here 5000 RPMs okay so let's see what let's um, put it to the test and see what happens so as I did with the first fan I took screenshots of testing the fan so let's see here this is we're just turning on the laptop nothing special no tweaking no settings just turn it on leave it on for a while and then 
here's the new fan here's the new one once again it does work it does but for my taste not for gaming um, this here just the motherboard alone once you put it in a game um, I was testing the new Warhammer and it can go up to 150 60 even higher depending on what part of the game you're in and going from this to this without doing anything with no gaming that's for me for gaming that's not a big drop and of course with my portable air conditioner this is a big drop so with this i'm confident in playing a video game now what i have here on the bottom is the other fan that i already returned the first video i made so we can see which one is more powerful and as we can see it looks like they were correct even though it's less rpms because of the way it's made it actually cools better so this one here is the the, the one on top is the 5000 rpms you're thinking industrial it's going to rush more air but it didn't cool as much as the one with the 3500 rpms and i had it on max on the new one as well so but i still don't want this here i rather have the one with the air conditioner so that's it as always no nothing fancy in my videos i'm just showing you raw data and for those who are looking for a fan to cool um, your laptop they're good but not for gaming so i would recommend strongly if you're not gaming um the bottom one which was the lano version 10 um, and um, i'll have the links included with the video so there you go if you have any questions uh, feel free to message me on facebook take care be safe